two, one. Hi, my name is Carson Deals. I am doing the fire tetrahedron for my science fair experiment. Uh, the fire tetrahedron includes the fire triangle. In order to create the fire triangle, you must have heat, uh, oxygen, and fuel. Heat must have uh, some type of uh, heat to produce a uh, heat source to produce a flame. All uh, fuels. Fuels include uh, solids, liquids, and gas or gases. Always remember, all fuels must be reduced to a vapor in order to produce a flame. Oxygen and oxygen and atmospheric air is made of uh, about 80% nitrogen and 20% uh, oxygen. To produce a, a sustainable flame, you need uh, about 16% oxygen. The fire tetrahedron uh, is uh, the added chemical reaction. When uh, oxygen is introdu introduced to an oxygen depriver environment with lots of heat and fuel, open flaming will occur. The purpose to my experiment is, the purpose of this project is to determine which common liquid and household products when combined with other household products will produce enough oxygen to start a fire. Experimental procedure. Add one teaspoon of baking soda and yeast to all three of the graduated cylinders. Put the yeast in, and you put the baking soda in. Then after you get those two items in, you mix them around. After mixing them, you add in five milliliters of water in the water beaker. And then you add the peroxide. and the vinegar. If you notice, these two are the only ones that have a chemical reaction, which are the vinegar and the hydrogen peroxide. The water, however, does not have any. You mix all three like this. Take a match. Light a match. Light this stick. Side. There you go. Good. Water. Let this burn for five seconds. You put it in the vinegar, goes out. Put it in the hydrogen peroxide, relights. Put it in the water, nothing really happens. Put it back in the vinegar. Yes. Hydrogen peroxide, water, vinegar, hydrogen peroxide. Okay. After you get done doing that, you, you repeat putting all three of those in as I just showed. That is my science fair experiment. The chemical reaction to these two are because when you, when this one, this one can't produce enough oxygen. What does it produce? This one produces uh, 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 carbon dioxide. This one produces pure, pure, pure oxygen. And mm, this one just 
doesn't really do anything. It just sits there and does nothing. Uh, these two have a chemical reaction because when they when combine with the mixture of the yeast and baking, so baking soda, they bubble up like this, mix these up, put the popsicle stick in there, and, and this one has enough oxygen where it'll mm, mm, re, mm, relight the, the popsicle stick. However, when you put it in this one, it, mm, uh, it, it, uh, blo or it burns it out. So therefore, this one carries more oxygen and this one carries more carbon dioxide. That is my science fair project for this is my science fair project for the 2014 50th anniversary of the science fair um, at St. William's Catholic School. And that was my science fair for the fire toucher hadron. Thanks.